Hello everyone, this is Dan with Dan's 30 Foot Doorbell. This is my eight take. Yes, number eight. My God. <sighs> Camera fell six times. And then my wife needed me in the house. She didn't know I was videotaping or whatever you wanna call this. <laughs> uh, okay, so every time I redo the tape, something changes. You see all these braces behind me are half gone. It's because on the other videos I've taken, I removed them on video. Now I'm doing this again, and I don't have as much bracing up. What I might do is just turn around and post the botched up videos anyway, so you can see what I did at that time. Uh, I'm sure you'll be well entertained considering that um, my middle name is Craziness. Uh, that's what I said, my middle name is Craziness. Uh, so I had some cross bracing here earlier. It's gone, it's lying on the ground right there. I took all the two by fours off each side that were there in order to, uh, um, in order to what? In order to find screws I couldn't find. So I took them out of, I took them all out of the framing. Those are that's a four inch screw. I need these for the bracing. So that I'm gonna put in across, I'm gonna put two pieces back there. Uh, you can see one's already in place. Another one will go the other way. And then I'm gonna put a piece of bracing a little, uh, probably in the wide area right here in front of the camera, uh, almost where I am, a little further, maybe back here, there'll be another bracing like this. And I'll put a two by four in between and put screws in it. So there's absolutely no sideways movement. Now, after that, um, I wanna put a few four inch screws in the rub rail because the screws in it, I do not want to uh, s depend on them solely. So what I'm gonna do is probably see if these screws are lo uh, long enough to be put in from the back here and into the rub rail to help hold it, secure it more. Because I don't have the carriage bolts that I said that I was going to use to um, secure those in place yet. Yeah. So, uh, so, uh, so, uh, so, uh. So the plan is I'm going to take the rest of this little frame apart. You can watch if you want. I mean, I don't got much to show you except for what I actually do. Um, you know, real time, I guess. Let's call it real time. Uh now you can see that other one down here, running up here, right there. That is about to come off. And then I will cut that material down to fit in here. I got this one here. I actually got two two by fours together right here. I take the screws out of that. That'll give me two for the front here. And I think that one there will give me the other one to go across here. Low battery, low battery, low battery. Now I have low battery. So here, this is, that's where I'm taping the phone up to. All that has to come off. You see that support there? All that has to come off. I'm taking this off. Can you see that? I hope so. What am I videotaping? Oh, for God's sake. Okay, all this has to come off. That There's that two by four. There's one, this one will be attached this way. The other one will be attached that way with the two by four in the middle. A little piece in the middle with some screws in. Now the idea is to drop this side to the ground or this side to the ground. And then I'll tie the rope on this cross brace here and rotate the boat up and over and skid it down one way. I'm not too sure which way I'm going to go, but um, we're definitely going to figure that out because if I don't do this today, I want to try it tomorrow for sure, the flip. Um, I have a camera stand. Of course, I can't find it. So what the hell with that, right? So uh, hopefully you got a good picture of some of those. 
That brown brace has to come off. You can see that one over my head has to come out. I'm taking all the braces out. So I'm just hoping that the whole boat won't fall forward now. So that there's, there's nothing really supporting it from just falling forward. And then the nose getting pushed into the ground up in the front there. So again, I got to remember not to lean on this thing. <laughs> Talking about playing Russian roulette. Okay, this is going to be video number one. My battery's about to die. That's how long I've been playing around with this camera, trying to get something going. But uh, we're good. I mean, it's better than no video at all, I guess. I kind of like showing everybody what I'm doing, you know. And uh, I am seriously trying to flip this by tomorrow. And I don't care what it takes. Now, like I said, yeah, on the flip, we're going to get some scuffing going on. That nice paint job of mine. I know it. I know it. I certainly know it. Hello, puppy. Oh, puppy, puppy, puppy. Yeah, it's a good puppy. Yeah, and there's the big puppy over there. Hey, Ruby. Ruby and Zeus. That's Zeus over there. Hey, Zeus. And this is my little Ruby. Ruby, say hello to everybody, Ruby. Okay, she doesn't know what we're doing here. She's just with me. She likes that, eh? A canoe. My little canoe, as I like to call her sometimes. Okay, folks. So, listen. I'm wrapping up this video. Um, as soon as I get this phone recharged, I'll be back out here to continue. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put all the bracing in while the phone's charging. I'm sorry. Um, I just can't wait for the video the, the, for the phone. Um, after eight tries or seven tries, I'm getting a little tired of uh, attempting it, but it's the only way to bring you something to see. Now, I don't know if you, I can show you this, but you see that two by four right there? See these two by four? That's my floor. I raise that nine inches from here to here. So I can, uh, I don't know, foam it, put something. Arr, arr, arr. Look who wants my attention, eh? Look who wants my attention, eh? They're a handful, but they're my dogs. Okay, guys, I'm going to let you go. <laughs> Get this bloody phone charged and uh, try to bring you sequel number two. Okay? Yeah, it ain't easy crawling around under here. My God, I got to keep on reminding myself just to take it easy. I'm not used to doing that. I like to go, go, go and get her done, right? So this is Dan with Dan's 34 Dory Build. Almost flooped that one up. Uh, I have some new subscribers. Thank you for very much for subscribing. I uh, haven't lost anybody since I started this project. Thanks for hanging in there, guys and gals. Yes, sir, Bob. Okay, so we're going to check in a little bit. Probably take about a half an hour to charge this phone, and I'll be right back. Okay, thank you.